Okay, so anybody that saw my uh, video beach comb yesterday saw me get all these little pieces of wood. There's caught wood bark, little carvable piece um, from the beach when I was beach combing. I got all these sticks and I got this stump. So what I want to do in this video today is <laughs> I want to, uh, I got some little tiny nails here. Okay, just finishing nails. Or I got a broad nailer. And I want to try and make a face on this um, piece of stump here. I think it's yellow cedar actually. So my plan is I'm not, I'm not allowed to break anything. Well, I'm going to make break some of these sticks. But I'm not allowed to carve anything, okay? So like, see here, I want to put on a nose and I want to put on the eyes and stuff. And see, I know this thing's going to look funny. But it's just something different than carving, right? I'm going to put my music on, start putting these pieces on, and just see if I can make a face. I will make it so there's like, you can put a pot up here. And, um, well, I just don't know what I'm going to do. All right, I just don't know. Ah. Okay, so I think the most important thing of this is, this is just a silly project, guys, just to show you that anybody can do it, is establish your eye line here. So you can see there's a white line going across here, and then my nose line. But I want to show you guys this piece here. This is a piece that my mom and dad made me and my sister when we were a kid. We're talking like five years old. This is the longest thing that I've, I've held on to my life. I'm 47 years old now. I've had this since I've been five. It's This is where I get the idea from this. You know, it was just a piece of wood. My mom put some thumbtacks in here and there was some, some of that orange nylon rope as the thing's hair, but I guess it's all gone now. And I guess my mom put some lipstick on as lips on there, but this was when my mom and real dad were still together. So I've saved this. And it was just tucked away in a closet. So, you know, that's how you kind of... I'm getting the idea for this thing kind of deal, right? So anyways, um, I'm going to bang on a nose. I got a little um, ballpoint hammer here. The nails. And I'm just going to try and nail it on first before I pull out the air thing in the friggin' air gun. <laughs> oh, boy. Okay, so let's establish this guy's nose here. So we got all these bits and pieces here, so it's kind of like Eedy beedy mighty mo catch a booty booty doo. Anyways, this is the one I found on the beach yesterday. It was already broken like that. Like I said, I'm not allowed to break any pieces. So be this, I did find this piece actually thinking it will be the nose. So look, I think, I think it's the nose. Okay, so you can see there we got the nose on. Most of this stuff is actually, this is cottonwood bark. So now for the eyes, you kind of want to, I don't know. I hooked up my uh, broad nailer because it's just a lot easier than hand nailing the nails in. So anyways, actually before I put the eyes on, eyebrows on, I think I want to put this piece here. Yeah. I think so. It can be whatever you want it to be. Okay, so who here remembers the game Mr. Potato Head? So that's what this is kind of <laughs> kind of like Mr. Potato Head. Okay, so this is what we got so far. We got a bottom lip in here. Well, I don't even know if that's the bottom lip, but this is just about having fun, right? Yeah, I'm using the brad nailer. It's saving a lot of time. Yes, you're seeing the little nail heads. But if you don't have a bread nail or air compressor, just get some little finishing nails and do it with that. You know, it's a good, it's a good um, project if you got kids or something, you know. So this isn't anything elaborate. It's just about making something for your yard, right? It gives you a yard character. And um, so anyways, now I think we need to make a bottom piece for the eyes, like an eye socket. I might end up breaking some wood pieces. This one was already broken, but I just got to try and figure this out anyways but Jordy what is it well if you look it's a Spartan friggin gladiator of the wood well it looks like a two-year-old made it well that's why I just like it so much more yep 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 So when I was working on this piece, I was thinking, what was the benefits of me making this piece? Like, what are the benefits of 
making something like this. Well, it's silly as all hell or whatever you want to say, but it helps. It helped me making this piece. Number one. Okay, I got a list written up. Number one. It got me out of the house yesterday, go beach combing, looking for little pieces of wood and opens up your mind. Number two, it's not dusty. It's not loud. Anybody can do it. It doesn't have to be a face. It can be a fish. You guys can see the pros, what they make out of driftwood. If you just um, Google search driftwood art, like they make real size horses and stuff. Okay. I said it opens up your mind. It opens up your mind. Yep. My mind was open when I was doing this. Creative. Number three, it's completely free. Anybody can do it. You don't have to have a beach. You could have a river. You could have a stream. You could have a lake. You could have a forest. You could have a wooded area. Go look for old branches that fell down. Simple as that. Number four, it makes a great gift. It's just like, don't worry about the, the nails and the eyes. See how I put them all in there like that? Because the shiny nails are going to get rusty within a couple months in the rain. And it's they're going to give it more character. Right? Look, he's even got ears. So as long as you have fun and just enjoy yourself, that's what it's about. Okay, this guy's got a big bottom rock jaw kind of thing. I don't know. Whatever. Right? Look, he's cross-eyed, kind of. Anyways, let's get him outside, see how he looks outside. So here you go. Nothing fancy. Just some nails, some driftwood. Real simple. Rock jaw. Let's get them wet with the hose. There you go. That's all. Hope you're all good. If you didn't like this video, uh, please subscribe. I'll be making more videos you won't like too. So, right on. Thank you.